Hello, this is Ashwin Vidyala here. I, I came across this picture and <coughs> it was meant to be a joke, but it actually um, inadvertently taught, taught me something. It reminded me of something rather. So there's this picture of, it's a black and white picture of Einstein just sitting all, you know, like the way he sits, I guess, looking at the camera, you know, sideways. And it says, this is how I felt like when I was in school. And then right below this, there's a little monkey <laughs> reading a book. Uh, it has a piece of paper in its hand. And, and the, the, the picture, uh, the caption is, this is how I feel like when I'm in college. So Einstein, you felt like Einstein when you were in school and you feel like a monkey, a dumb monkey when you're in college. The more you know about a subject, the more you know that you don't know. The more educated you are on a particular topic, the more you realize how much you don't know about that subject. And I'll take the example of, uh, I'll give you my personal example, uh, physics. When I was in school, you know, it was like basic friction stuff and forces and all. And I was like, okay, I know, I get this shit. And then when I came to college and I took a university physics course, the, it was the same concept, but the depth that we went into was unbelievable. And also, and then you real, the more you get into it, the more you realize how much you don't know. I thought I was pretty good at math when I took calculus too. But then when I went to linear algebra, and the prerequisite for that class is calculus too. And I thought, okay, calculus too, no big deal. It, not that it was easy, but I could do it. Linear algebra, when I went to that course, I just, it was like this whole world of math opened up to me that I had absolutely no clue of. The more you know about something, the more you realize that you don't know. If somebody comes and talks to you, like they know everything, very good chance they're not an expert because experts always know that the information that's out there that they are not aware of is way greater than what they know. And that keeps them humble, which is why the more intelligent people very often, in fact, almost always, are more humble than the idiots because the idiots don't know anything. They just know a little bit about something and they think they know it all. But the true experts know a lot more and then, then they realize that the amount of information that's out there that they have no clue about far exceeds their limited knowledge. And it's good to be in that state, in that point of being humble because that keeps you in the learning mode. And you always want to be in the learning mode because if you're not growing, you're dying. The greatest teachers are always the greatest students because they understand that what they don't know far exceeds what they do know. If you like this video and you want to check out more videos like this, do check out my blog, theindianguy.com, theindianguy.com. I just took my last final and now I celebrate.